Okay. Um, right. These are the components for a water battery cell. And uh, I think we're going to be able to link these together the same as the earth battery cells. Foam, three slices off. Moth cuts for wadding to create pressure where you want it onto the copper. 32 square inches. And the galvanized, which amounts to 18 square inches, all to go in that container. Okay, we have the galvanized and the copper and the sponge set up here. Right, this is a water battery test, no soil, two electrodes in there, three pieces of sponge separating them, just ordinary tap water, just giving us 0.65 amps of DC. You go, it's trying to go to one volt AC. It will make it if I leave it longer, I'm sure. Volts DC, and that will climb a little yet, but we're going to stop it here. And now I'm going to add some salt. Okay, half a teaspoonful of salt, and a quarter of a pint of water. It's now been added, and DC volts. 0.87 a few minutes. Alternating current 1.2 volts. And here we have the bee's knees. Our amperage is now up to 3.96 DC. It's trying to go higher, but I'll leave it there. You get the gist.